Rose and a Cow interview, part two. Uh, right after Auburn's Music Conversation, <laughs> weekly stage it show every Thursday, yada, yada, yada. <laughs> All right. Is there an elephant in the room? No. No, we're very honest and open here, so. All right. I was wondering if you're going to take that literally or not. I went with the figure. Too. Yeah. <laughs> This one's kind of gross. Uh oh. Can you blow bubbles with spit? Um, I've actually never tried that, so. So you don't. Know. A mystery yet to be uncovered. I can. <clears throat> I'm proud of you. <sighs> Just saying. What would you do <laughs> if a pan? I don't mean to brag, but I. Can. <laughs> 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 well, you know. <laughs> Among <laughs> other things. <laughs> kind of a big deal. Yeah, you know. Well, okay. All right. And I'll see you soon. Okay. What would you do if a panda entered the room and asked for a cigarette? Oh my gosh! First of all, I love pandas, so I'd be so excited, and then I would be so disappointed because, you know, smoking's bad. So yeah. I'd have to have a heart to heart talk with him. I probably have to become friends with a panda first before <laughs> I talk to him about right. smoking, because you don't want to just offend somebody. Right. And pandas are awesome. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Who would you rather chest bump, Dolly Parton or Kate Hudson? Um, that's why you're asking me that question. Yes, I asked okay. her before. I was making when I was making the questions. I'm like, name a flat-chested celebrity. I'm like, I wonder what questions she can put together from that one. Yeah. Um, I feel like I'm gonna have to say Dolly Parton. Yeah. It would be Plus, a little cushier. Yeah, that's I'm just what saying. I'm saying. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Who is your least favorite Disney princess? Oh, um, um, probably the Princess Frog one. Mm. Maybe just because I was older when it came out, and I yeah. don't really like the movie that much. Mm. I don't know. Well, yeah. She's not a classic princess. That's what I'm saying. I mean, just I, I don't it's know. It's okay. Racist. I mean, <clears throat> oh my gosh, that's kidding. not why. <laughs> I know, I know, I'm just kidding. I shouldn't have said that because I hear you. <laughs> no, I totally get what you're saying. I know. It's not one I grew up on. It's not, you know. No, I know. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Would you rather kiss a penguin or a giraffe? Um, I feel like it'd be more awkward to kiss a penguin, but I really like penguins, so I'm just gonna go with that. Yeah. I think giraffes beard, like to, like, stick their tongue out and cool. stuff, so. It's like the Miley Cyrus giraffe. <laughs> <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. All right. Okay. What would you do if Angelina Jolie wanted to go out for coffee with you? I would respectfully decline. Really? Oh. Just because? No, I mean, I wouldn't want her to steal my man or anything. Oh. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Would you hug Amy McAdams, or Rachel McAdams? Was it Rachel McAdams? You said Amy McAdams, but I think it was, I think it's Rachel. No, I meant Amy. <laughs> oh. I don't know who Amy McAdams is. You are redhead. You know that? I think it's Rachel. Rachel no. McAdams. She's in the Is notebook? It? No, that's... What up? How's it going? No. That, that's... It's a different actor. Okay. Amy's the one that's in, um... What was that one where it was like the fairy tale oh, in New York City? Oh, Enchanted? Yeah. Okay. I'm well, saying. would you hug her if I gave you a Klondike bar? Oh, yeah. Yeah? I'd do anything for a Klondike bar. Anything? That's, that's a dangerous statement what to make. What would you do for a Klondike bar? All right. Have you ever literally bit off more than you can chew? That sounds like a possibility. Yeah. Not that I can recall. Fair enough. All right, last question in part two. Okay. What is your survival plan for the zombie apocalypse? Um, I don't really have one, so I was thinking that I would probably just meet up with my friends that do have one. Yeah, I have some friends that like. I've got a cabin in the woods, some guns, supplies. Right. I'm like, oh, well, we're friends, you know, so. 
So let me tag along. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. I don't want to put those plans into action myself. It just seems like too much. <laughs> too much you work. Know? So if it doesn't happen, I can be like, huh, you guys are idiots. You prepare for nothing. But if it does, I can be like, hey, you know, that was a good idea. Mm -hmm. Could come to you. I was totally on board with that from the beginning. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I'm like, you guys were so smart. Let me come to you. Right. All right, well, that's it. Thanks so much, guys. And check her out online, rosenacow.com and yep. Facebook and YouTube, all that rock. Yep. I'm going to put the, the thing down here. So. Okay. Well, no one can hear me if it's over there. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right, thank you so much. You are shy and you're outspoken. You are perfection.